ladies and gentlemen. Gentlemen and ladies. Ladies and gents. Could it be that I'm falling in love with this blockchain thing? Ladies and gentlemen, I told you I wanted to create my own blockchain so that I could do exactly what Barry is doing, but on a much smaller scale, because I understood what was going on with all of this. Now, I want you to pay attention to something, and I hope that I have your ear. There are individuals out there trying to say that the Barry cryptocurrency trading platform is a joke, that they are illegal that they are doing something wrong, that the numbers don't add up. Now, I promise you, nobody could be more critical than I am. Y'all know me. Told everybody to be cautious from day one. So let's, no, no, let's see if Barry is legitimate or not. Now, according to the guy's video, none of these coins are traded, especially these down here. He even brings up this one right here. So this is CFC. But this is a new coin, so we don't want to do that. We want to do CNL because he talks about AGC and CNL that they're not traded on any other platform. Okay, so let's go. Let's see. We're going to stop you right there. AGC. Wake up. Cryptocurrency exchange. Question mark. Stop listening. Ladies and gentlemen, we need to see whether or not AGC is a legitimate currency because they said that Barry Exchange made it up. Well, look at that, AGC. Look at what it's trading at. And look at that. Oh, look at that, AGC. Look at, man, how in the world could AGC have been created by Barry when it's traded on Coinbase, another blockchain? Okay, and you ain't going to be traded on Coinbase or any of the other platforms without being verified. Okay, cryptocurrency exchange rate. It even tells you the exchange rate. So let's find out what it says here about AGC. Arbacap Global Coin is a cryptocurrency that was created in 2022. It is a decentralized currency that uses the Ethereum blockchain, AGC can be used to make payments, send and receive money, invest in other cryptocurrencies. There is a number of exchanges that allows you to buy and sell AGC. Some of the most popular exchanges include these. And you notice Barry's not even listed. But they said that Barry, the guy in his video says that AGC was created by Barry. Let's try the other one, CNL. That's a currency that they said it's, oh, that rate, the value is $180 per share. And so it was created by Barry. The conversion value of one CNL to 0 0.004, this is 4% of a penny. Okay? Ladies and gentlemen, they said Barry created that. So let's, let's see what uh, Bard is going to say. Walk around with my hand in my hands. Baby. Uh oh, there's he says there's no cryptocurrency called CNL. Really? See, I can't because I can't do anything here. Dang it. I can't put this over there to correct his stupidity. CNL token. Okay, then you got coin codex. And who else do we have? Let me see. Where's my other CNL people at? CNL price today, stock, CNL, and a value chart. It's called Coin Data Flow. You know what? I don't know anything about Coin Data Flow, but let's go ahead and go to the Coin Data Flow. I'm, I'm interested. What we're going to do is we're going to test the other coins directly in here. I apologize, ladies and gentlemen. That's what's my spinners in my background, and I don't have no, no list going on. And I want to play something else, but I don't know what to play. Oh, lordy, lordy, lordy. There's not a lot of music here, so we're going to just to be close to you, girl. Just for a moment, baby. Wow. 
just for an hour. All right. They'll be on in a minute. Come on now, play. I ain't got time. They they don't want to they don't want to talk up y'all. They they quiet. Okay, so let's go crypto. You, you, you hear what I'm talking about? They didn't want to they wanted to make an interest. So we have Tether USDT and we trade in Tron. And Tron is the only one they allow you to transfer through MoonPay to USDT. Okay, these are the ones we trade in, but they say that the Berry Exchange makes up all of this stuff. So, ladies and gentlemen, I have to kill that stupidity. I'm not here to back up Barry. I've been been through so many changes in my life. You know, I've been through so many highs and so many lows. You know what I'm saying? Where I don't need anyone. Sorry. Y'all know I can't let my music play in the background. I've been down real low where I thought I didn't need anyone. I thought nobody cared for me but me. And this is where we put our funds at in Trust Wallet. Now, we don't have to do that. That's what we use. Material things, I thought I had so much value. See, he says value. <laughs> anyway, let me go ahead and show you one other thing, ladies and gentlemen. This is important to me that you see this part right here. There are two things that you guys need to understand. Uh, we got one more to go back to. No direction and no purpose. No one will love me. For me. Oh, you came into my life. You made my Jagged Edges. Where do you think the group Jagged Edges got their name from? Pretty new. Oh, woman. You became my purpose. My reason for living. My soul, my soul, inspiration, baby. I apologize, y'all, but y'all know I can't play my music in the background without me singing and opening my arms to you. Why don't you take my hand? So what we're going to do, ladies and gentlemen, is this right here. We're going to put in F-S-G-L-O-B-A-L, and we're going to... We're going to do, I don't want FS Global and Barry. I don't want it telling me what I want. I want to do South Africa. S-O-U-T-H-A-F-R-I-C-A. Because the company that's doing all of this, that's funding all of this, is not Barry. It is FS Global. They are the company that's handling things. So let's find out about FS Global. Because I'm curious about FS Global. Just for an hour. You guys remember We Are The World, Michael Jackson, and the group he was working with in South Africa? Well, hold on. Let's see if we can get there. Now, it blocked me the last time. Hey! Ooh, ooh, ooh. I know. You, you, just can't, you can't stand it, can you? But it's a nice song. For so very long. Babe. And since I got to wait for it, you got to wait for it, too. So we might as well have some entertainment while we do. So it is letting me get to the site now. Before it, it blocked me, Google said, no, nah, you ain't going to South Africa. I said, Google, I'm going to go to South Africa. Make the world a better place. Hold on. Kill the world. Make it a better place for you and for me and the entire human race. How do you think they got their start? Shh, don't tell nobody. Anyway, no, that's not how they got their start. Go ask them. This is that's their website. Go ask them. But see, what we did is by taking you to FS Global, FS Global is the one who's taking their reputation on this. See, FS Global is a charitable organization. They receive money from all kinds of agencies and corporations and companies. If they were pulling a scam or a scam on people, then they would lose their reputation. And South Africa, nor any country in Africa, is the place where you want to lose that reputation. Okay, we're going to go back one. I don't want to go there. I want to go here because I want to hear what Bard has to say. Now, I like this combination here where we have both Bard and um, ChatGPT. We get them side by side. I don't mind having that at all. And that's an app that you can go to the Google extension store and you can have Bard and ChatGPT side by side. 
okay, where you get the comparison side by side, you put whatever it is you want right here, and this is their response over here. Ladies and gentlemen, Barry and FS Global Charitable Organization. That's all they're doing. Now look, FS Global has over 1 million members. Can you imagine them? Look, people, this is what you need to understand. They just introduced what's called the Barry coin today. Today, this was the opening of the Barry coin and the amount of revenue they were telling people that they could have access to as a result of buying into their coin and how they were going to give them some of the residuals of the accumulated interest because that's all they're doing is giving people residuals of accumulated interest do you know why the berry platform works i'm going to tell all of you why the berry platform works i've been waiting to tell this to people because people are not getting it i understand the mathematics of what's going on today so that you all understand what's going on we're going to go to the coin right now it's not wait did, did they put it here it's not here yet because it's not being traded on Ladies and gentlemen, we have to go to assets. No, I don't want to change my language. Stop that. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, here in assets, we're going to go down here to the bottom. This is the new Berry coin. I have 5,905 shares of this Berry coin. Okay, that's just what I got. I bought it at 150. Now let's find out where it's at right now. Because you can't see it trading on the market. It's just not there yet. We're going to go right here. Orders. No, I can't even go to orders because that's not going to. That's orders is not going to show it to me. I got to go here. And then I got to go here. Ladies and gentlemen, right now. And it's not even the second part. This is the second part. The first part went to 106.9%. This is the anticipation. Guess how much they sold of their own coin today. 1 billion with a B as in Baker. Ladies and gentlemen, do you understand that that's a billion of their coins that individuals are invested in at 1.5 per coin? They sold a billion. Do you know how much revenue that is? And it it sits there for 15 days. Why? Because they're gaining the accumulated interest. That's how they can promise residuals coming back to people because that's a billion dollars that's gaining at least 3% interest daily for 15 straight days, just sitting there, just accumulating the interest without anybody interfering with it. It's just sitting there. It's what we refer to as being staked. But hold on, tomorrow they're going to be offering the same opportunity, but instead of 70% gains, 70%, that's right, they promised 70% back. That's why they took 70%. They're promising 70% back on the first one. Tomorrow they're releasing another volume of the same coin, which was their plan always, at 50%. That's right, so it's going to be, I think it's going to cost the same amount, but they're going to take 50% of people's remaining holdings and give them back the other 50% to trade on for the next 15 days. So you'll still get to trade for the next 15 days. And your money will just sit in an account for 15 days accumulating interest. And they're going to debit up that interest and divide it up and give individuals back the interest. Plus their original deposit. That's what they're doing. Because they just created value in their own coin. Ladies and gentlemen, they sold a billion coins. Now, how many of you can sell a billion coins? That's a feat in and of itself. But we have people out there trying to tell everybody, get out, don't buy anything, they're going to take your money. I don't know what they're going to do tomorrow. I don't know if this is legitimate or not. I just know I'm not going to listen to those idiots making videos who's got a point to prove. I'm telling you and showing you guys what I've experienced. There are going to be other offers after this. This offer, we knew about this coming for, for at least a month. We knew that this was coming. Okay? We knew that they were going to trade again tomorrow. And understand, tomorrow, tomorrow, I love me, tomorrow. Anyway, bet you believe you want the Commodores back, don't you? Ladies and gentlemen, I started out with $12,000 to sell. 70%, 70% left me with 3000 about 3000 $500 because I added some commissions to this. So 
ladies and gentlemen, that's what this is. This is the residuals, and then they will take half of this tomorrow. I don't mind them taking half and letting it stock and sit over there. That's going to be almost 8,000 of these coins that will come to me. Now, hold on now. We're going to play my Commodores again. Ladies and gentlemen, this is going to put me right up in this area right here. Which means that in 15 days, I will have over $46,000 in the account for the organization. This is the profit in 15 days. That's if it gets to $7.50. Now, right now, because it's hovering right about $3.50, tomorrow it's going to be higher. And it's going to keep doing that. Now, hold on. Let's do this right here. It, it's got that counterfeit thing. I'm going to take care of that later. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, just so all of you know, so that you get it, right here, if it goes up to $15 a share, this is the potential for the organization. Stop listening. Sorry about that. That's why it was jumping, because the voice recognition was on. So, ladies and gentlemen, the potential for individuals, this is accumulated interest that they're doing. They're not taking anything from anybody. How can they do this? Why, why would they do something like that? Because they're not sitting up here trying to take advantage of people. Remember, people said the same thing about me, that the organizations that I put together was trying to take advantage of people. We have given back more to people than they ever could have given us. And we've said that time and time again. These people are doing the exact same thing. Do not think that there's only one person on this planet who operates like me. There are others. It's just that you are not able to come in contact with them too often because too many people try to badmouth, and then there are a bunch of them that made a bad name for everybody. You know, they sit up here and act like they're trying to help people and then take advantage of them. So, of course, you don't know who to trust. But I've been listening and anticipating and analyzing and critiquing every single thing they've done. And so far, they haven't done anything that makes me go, wait a minute, hold up. So, ladies and gentlemen, don't listen to the videos of individuals bad-mouthing something unless they can show you proof. And just because they say they got proof and they don't show anything, hold on so that you guys get it. Go back and look at all my videos where I'm showing you what I'm doing every single day and how I'm pointing out to you the only thing that we're doing here is accumulated interest. That's all. Look. A cumulative income. This is all we're doing is accumulated interest. We're, there, it's not money. It's interest in the coin. And then when we close out the coin, that's all she wrote, everybody. That's what's going on here. That's all that's going on here. So there are some jealous people out there, and they may have some concerns, but they're going about it the wrong way. If you got concerns about something, show your proof. Don't just sit up here and say something. Show proof. Here's the other coin. I just, me and the staff just pulled up this coin earlier because I was showing them this. Ladies and gentlemen, come on now. Let me close out this one. Right here, Berry Exchange, Lakewood, Colorado. Ladies and gentlemen, FS Global and Berry, FT, uh, FDPT. This is ChatGPT's 3D printing. ChatGPT's 3D printing. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, reviews. Read customer service reviews on Barry.im. Why would I want to go to here? I don't know who no trust pilot is. Who, who the, is this? Okay. Why would I go there? I don't know these people. I don't know what agenda they have. Okay. I don't know these people. I don't know who these 57 people are. But what I guarantee you I can do, let's see if FDPT uh, is traded on the market. Watch this. We're going to go here, and we're going to put value. Like Lana Richie said, I thought it had so much value. Can somebody let them know it's not value, it's value? See, the E is silent. Anyway, I'm, I apologize. I thought it had so much value. Oh, no, we're going to play this from the very beginning. This is Sweet Love, and uh, YouTube has a habit of muting my videos when we're on here, so I'm going to have to 
go to settings and do that unmute thing because we ain't gonna be playing that mute stuff. Nope, it ain't got no, it ain't got no, it won't let me unmute it. And so I'm just gonna have to survive it because that's just the way it is. So we're gonna have to play Sweet Love by the Commodores. And so y'all just gonna have to deal with Sweet Love. Ladies and gentlemen, I need to know its value. Okay, so let's find out what FDPT's value is. Oh, by the way, and you're going to see a lot of Facebook platforms talking about all kind of stupidity, but FDPT is the 4D printing technology. Okay, it's 4D printing technology. I don't know what 4D printing technology is, ladies and gentlemen, but I, knew it, I do know it was introduced by ChatGPT. Let's go here. Whoa, 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 show me a place where dreams are for dreamers. Ah, everything you wish come true, yeah. Sorry, it's one of those songs, ladies and gentlemen. I'm not able to see it trading, and that's the problem, because I know it's trading. Whoa, 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 whoa. Give me one second. And you guys, do yourselves a favor. Please stop going by these idiots who claim that they're giving you the truth or that they're telling you the truth. Make them show it to you. And if they're not showing it to you, don't believe these. Sorry. I apologize. Wait. <laughs> Sorry. It's the song. Hey, no, y'all wasn't supposed to do that. You weren't supposed to change that. Commodores. Sorry, they, they're not supposed to change the classics. They, they're not supposed to change the classics. See, I'm looking. I know because I found it earlier, and I don't know why it's not here now. FDPT, I found it earlier. So let's do the 3D tech, 4D technology. Yeah, see, they, they done did this backwards, and I don't like it when they do the song like that. I didn't tell them to take my song and change it, so we're going to have to go talk to them. And there'll be no sweet love. Hold on. I'm more interested in the 4D printing because I found it earlier in the fact that I'm talking about it on video and I can't find it now. We got to go. Wait, come on now. Now my screen is frozen, so we got to pause y'all for a second. And me and the Commodores, we're going to take care. Oh, there you go. That's what I'm listening for right there. That right there. Ooh, 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 ooh. Man, show me a dream, y'all. This is uh, the Commodores, and it just brings back some memories. And I don't know why my screen is playing these games because there was a YouTube video and I was going to click on it. Everyone's heart of gold. Sweet love. Come on now. It's not showing me what it showed me. See, this is not the same coin. This FDPT is in all capital letters for a reason. 4D printing. So we're going to go to videos. I should wait for Bard, but we're not going to, we ain't got that type of time. See, y'all got to admit, brings back a lot of memories, don't you? He says convincing people about, there's no need to convince you. Hi, leaders. Have you seen the new coin? It's better than all the previous coins. Buying price $30, cheap and affordable, blah, blah, blah. We are growing and growing fast. Now, front foot of technology, of constantly emergency, constant, constantly emerging with FDPT, 4D, while the crypto market is losing capitalization every day. Ladies and gentlemen, you must understand, Barry is kicking people's butt. They just did a billion 
at least a billion today. They're a $20 billion organization. The first thing people are going to say, well, they don't have any money. Ladies and gentlemen, the one thing Barry is doing is saving his money. You can tell that they are not extravagant. Even the FS Global, the amount of money they have, you can see they're not extravagant. And I was just looking at the way I live, and I guarantee you I ain't nobody's extravagant. Okay, I am right here. Friends, according to tradition, here is the latest. I'm... I can't look at that. I'm looking for the FDPT, and I don't see it. These videos, those videos are too short. They're all 29 minutes. They're all TikTok type videos. I ain't got time for TikToks. I was trying to look for real videos. You know, TikTok ain't no video. A little bit harder to love. So I can't do FDPT now because it's not showing it. Wait, hold on. Let's do this this way. Day by day. Yeah, I can do it here. But love is the only way, y'all. Need us love. So let's see what chat G... And this is Bard. See, he says there's no currency called... And it is a new coin that was introduced on that blockchain, but I do know that it was on being traded on other blockchains. I'm still in development, blah, 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 blah. FDPT is a cryptocurrency that is not traded on any major exchange. It is a very small and illiquid cryptocurrency. And its value is highly volatile. Its value is not highly volatile. It is recommended to... It is not recommended to invest in FDTP because it is a high-risk investment. If you are interested in cryptocurrency, recommend you do some research, blah, 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 blah. In S-W-E-R, my question. I didn't ask it about valuation. This was not about volatility or anything because all, quote-unquote, things like this are volatile and the investment and the market is volatile. That doesn't make any sense, y'all, that it would answer like that. The value is 0.1 USD. Now, that's a lie. However, it is important to note that it's a very small liquid currency, blah, blah, blah. See, he did the same thing. So let's do that. Let's go to FDPT. And we're going to go spot trading. Sorry, ladies and gentlemen, that this is taking longer, but we have to do this because there are people out there wondering about these coins and their trade value. So it says... This thing is trading at $70 a share, but this idiot is saying that it is not. So what I'm going to do is this right here, because he says that it is highly volatile. So let's do this. Uh-uh, we ain't doing that. We talk to y'all later. Okay. According to Barry.am, the price is $70. The price has changed by 0.04% in the past 24 hours. 24 hours, the low was 70.40, so $70.40, and it went up to $70.78. Today's high was $70.80. 24-hour volume is 1 million FDPT. It is important to note that this, see, he's going to talk about volatile. Now, let me show you. He keeps saying that. Do you see? Why does he keep saying that? Why does he keep talking about highly volatile? Watch this. Let's do this. And he says, according to Barry.im. So he makes sure that he covers himself. Why does he want to dictate the conversation? So we're going to go here. And we're going to put that there. And what I'm going to do is take the previous conversation because I don't appreciate the fact that he kept saying the way he was saying. Uh, give me one second. Yeah, see, the fact that he keeps saying volatile and highly risky. Let me put it here in chat GPT. 
and we're just going to ask the question. Ain't no need to do anything else. Okay, 24-hour low means blah, 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 blah. The 24-hour trade volume is this, which is amount to traded in the market. The trading volume can be an indicator of the level of interest and the activity of the FDPT. It is worth noting that the currency price is subject to high volatility and fluctuations, and the price can occur rapidly uh, and unpredictably. It is important to be careful in considering the risk. Ladies and gentlemen, because we do spot trading, it is not, and the price can rise rapidly. Let me show you why they are claiming it's volatile. Hold on. That's not volatility. That's just the ups and downs of cryptocurrency. But I'm looking for when we trade in the coin. I should go to the coin we traded today. And so I can't show you when we trade in the coin on this one because it's not here. Because we haven't traded in it for two days. And so because we haven't traded in it for two days, you can't see when we come in. You see, that's the unique thing about the volatility. Now, the gentleman also said this, and I'm glad I stayed this long and I'm doing this. The gentleman said that because Barry does what it does to predict it, it gives us the actual coin that we're coming in on. Let me, I need to uncolorify that. Did you say colorify? I said colorify. This is a coin we traded in today. This is what people are not liking about Barry. This is how it creates the interest. Now, this coin, I'm, I'm going to show you this because this is important. This was us today. We came in right about here. Tick, 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 tock. And it stays up here for this long. Now, they say, well, when Barry and them are doing what they're doing, it's causing volatility with the currency and the coin. And it, 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 then it plummets. It goes all the way down to Jesus' sound. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, let me show you something so that you guys see the plummeting. It was here. This is 50.08. It went all the way to 52.40. Okay, then after, see, 50.41. But that says the average high. Pay attention. We went all the way to 52.40. That's what this is right here, 5241. Now pay attention. Look at how long it stays up. Does it go straight down? No. Look at it. Let's make it smaller. Come on now. Stop playing games with me. We're going to go up, 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 up. Okay. But this is hours it takes for that. Sorry, there was a bug who decided to touch me and I decided to touch him back. Let's see if he do that again. Now take a look. When it goes back down, it doesn't go straight down. It goes down because we've just taken our funds out, and it goes back up, and it doesn't go below. This is where it was when it started, ladies and gentlemen, right here. You see it ain't nowhere near where it started. But these idiots are saying that when Barry does what it does, it's having an effect of the currency. Remember, this is a currency that's trading on several different chains at the exact same time. It's not having an effect on the currency. When this goes up, you got to catch it on a rise because this happens within minutes. This happens within a total of five minutes. This right here. And then this happens over the course of several hours. So even if the individuals bought way back here, they can still make do all the way back down to where they settle at. This is Barry. This is what Barry does. I'm not here to convince you guys about Barry. I tell people always, always, always take your time, do your research, but don't listen to somebody telling you what it is. This guy says that it was having an effect on the coin. I had already shown you guys this before I even saw any stupid video like his, but I had already showed you that it's not having any effect on the coin because the coin goes back to its original value, if not a little bit higher. Okay? All the single time. Sorry, ladies and gentlemen. I was supposed to be playing uh, Stevie Wonder's ass. Okay, and y'all know. Do, 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 do. Okay, so I apologize to you all that I saved this part for last because this is the main thing he was talking about that it affects the coin. But what the thing that bothered me is that he said that these are not trading on the regular market. I just told everybody the fact that I am somewhat sold is because these things are trading on the regular market. Now, this is the C pick. I don't really like this particular coin. I don't like the way it trades. It doesn't operate normal. 
but the fact is when we trade in C pick and we haven't done it in several days, so I'm going to see if we can find a C pick because we probably will trade in it tomorrow <laughs> knowing what I'm saying. So this is not us. This is another group. Okay, but when we trade in C pick, that's what we can expect. Always. Okay, so ladies and gentlemen, I'm not going to keep you guys. My job was just to let you know that so far Barry is doing exactly what all the other blockchains are doing and all the other blockchains appear to be upset with Barry that Barry is doing what Barry is doing because they've been doing the same thing to everyone else okay it's just that remember this volatility is happening because of the other blockchains not because of Barry because this coin is being traded on the other blockchains so it's not Barry that's doing this because we are not trading in this right now I just showed you the coin we were trading in. Let's show you the other coin we traded in today. We traded in two coins today. We traded in AGC and the other one, CFC. No, I'm living for tomorrow. Now, you see how long this is taking to get to that high? That's us earlier today, ladies and gentlemen. This is what happens when we trade. Now, pay attention right here. This is 100.73. Sounds like a radio station then. Okay. Now, it went all the way up to 104. Now, look at how long it stays at 104. And then it comes down. Doesn't, there ain't no drastic come down. And what? it's still at 102. Still at 101. Look at how long it takes it. And what does it do? It never comes back down to where it was. It keeps going back up and stays up. So when they talk about what Barry does, and I want you all to see, we are starting the launch pad because we want to do exactly what Barry says. We want to bring people to come and get some accumulative interest. That's what we're doing. We don't care about all the other side talk because Barry doesn't need to take money from people when they can get the interest by just storing the funds. You see, as I said before, the way Barry is making a killing is it only allows you to get $10,000 out of your account per month. They do that, one, to keep liquidity because that's been a problem with every other Bitcoin and the other, not Bitcoin, but cryptocurrency and blockchain is they can't keep liquidity because people come in, get their money, and then run out. Well, no, Barry survives off of the interest. That's how it exists because of the accumulative interest. So that's Barry. That's their whole system in a nutshell i've known that since day one i told you it's creating an artificial rise which is causing interest to occur that's why it's incurring interest and what happens is everybody goes out at the same time they all sell right up here okay and because they all sell they gather that interest and they move on that happens every single time the only thing why it works with barry it's because we know what time we're buying and we know what time we're selling. We have the numbers in advance because they have an algorithm that they work with and it works every single time. Well, no, there's some time there's some glitches because of the volume. Look, this is not even the volume that we have most of the time. We are several million people trading, okay? So because several million people are all buying at the same time and several million people are all selling at the same time, we get to collect that interest of seven million people and it's evenly distributed. That's what's happening. And the more you have, the more cumulative interest you have means the more coins you have, which means the more interest you'll make the next time. So it is a cumulative interest that compounds, 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 gets larger and larger every month. So by the end of the year, you'll end up with... $100,000 if you do and play your cards right. Am I making sense? So, ladies and gentlemen, 39 minutes of me trying to explain to you is very legit. Make the choice for yourself. Choose for yourself based on the facts. Don't listen to those idiots try to tell you. Now, if there's something else that I have not seen, nobody's talked about it. I haven't seen it. I've been looking. I've been looking for something to go wrong. I tell people there's a shoe that's got to drop. The only thing I can see is the big boys who don't like the poor people making this type of interest. Because, see, they limited. This is the last thing I'm going to say. 
they're limited to $10,000 per month. Which one of you can't live off of $10,000 per month, no matter how much money you've accumulated? That means you get to create a portfolio documenting how many coins you have. Because if you have several, several hundred million in Bitcoin, then you leave it in Bitcoin. Let's say you don't want to be in Barry no more. Then you go and you, hold on, come on now. My mouse won't, it won't let me go up, y'all. See, I got I to gotta refresh. Give me one second. I know what's happening, and I, I got to undo that. See, I got to go to not here. I got to go here. Come on now. I want the Bitcoin one. So let's say I don't want to be in Barry anymore. Then I go into Bitcoin, and I go all in. I wait till Bitcoin goes down, like right about here, and I go all in on Bitcoin. The ratio is different, but I go all in on Bitcoin, and I can trade Bitcoin any place, anywhere, anyhow. But Bitcoin is not as stable. You see, there's more volatility in Bitcoin than any of the other coins. This is not us. But you see that steep drop right there? That's Bitcoin. We don't do Bitcoin. Okay, somebody else is doing that. And they have agreements with each other, these blockchains, on who gets to play games like this. So this happens all the time, ladies and gentlemen. Every time you see those little sharp rises and everything, that's the manipulation. Everybody manipulates stocks. Everybody manipulates cryptocurrency. Okay, that's what people do. That's what the hedge funds do and all of them. That's what they do. We're not about to do that. Okay, these little spikes right here, this is all spot trading where individuals are getting in and getting out. But look at how theirs take place over a couple of seconds and not uh, like ours over 15 20 minutes okay and they set theirs to hit this high price and that's what they get every single time that high so this is barry this is what barry is doing he's doing barry is i said he barry is doing the same thing as everybody else is doing it's just that they brought in a million people a million poor people because if you listen to them the people who founded barry they will tell you they're doing it for the poor africans so while we're trading here in the United States, the Africans are trading in Africa. They're getting the same numbers doing it at the exact same time. That's why this platform works. I can see it working this way. Now that I know they made a billion dollars today, a billion dollars in a coin that they created. They did create the coin. They created the Barry coin because it's their coin, just like Ethereum created its coin. Bitcoin created their coin. They created their own coin, which is what we told you we did. But they had a billion in sales of their own coin. A billion people. That's their valuation. That's why they can be worth $20 billion. This is not a game. These companies that are doing things like this, they're, they're not a little cheap company. There's a lot going on here. And when you listen to FS Global, you'll see what their goals are, what their aims are. So when you're listening to those people talk, and say things about FS Global or Barry, they're only talking out the side of their neck because it's not Ethereum, it's not Bitcoin, it's not Coinbase. And you look at each one of them, they're all having their own issues. But of course, they're gonna put people out there to say things to dissuade people from going to organizations like the Barry.im. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm not here because of their reputation. I'm here because for six and a half weeks, I went from Let's say we're going to do the whole amount, $1,500 to $17,000 in six and a half weeks. Oh, that's impossible. It's a cumulative interest, people. It is possible. If you're just doing the interest, it is 100% possible. And that's all this is about. Now, look, I got to go. I just wanted to share this information with you guys. I just wanted to dispel the stupidity of the individuals who are saying what they're saying and let you know that if you're going to go in, Go in small, get to know the system first, and then up increase your amount. We had a guy who deposited $10,000 the other day. Why? Because they guaranteed him they will match his $10,000 dollar for dollar. So he's $20,000 richer in coins, cryptocurrency, as a result of investing $10,000. That was his aim. That was his goal. He got exactly what he was asking. I put in $600, got $1,200 because I couldn't afford to put more than that. I'm, I'm broke now. 
Okay, not until because your funds have to stay in the account until two months. At the end of two months, then you can pull it out. Ladies and gentlemen, it's a cumulative interest. So I plan on leaving the funds in there for six months. But at, at this point right now, what's in the account, what's about to be in the account, do you know I can survive off of just one week's revenue? One week. I can survive easily. And so can you. You just have to patiently go through it. So we are inviting people to join this platform. There will be plenty of promotions because they're getting ready to go public. They're getting ready to trade on NASDAQ. There will be plenty of opportunities to get those bonuses and to get those special offers and to get your cumulative interest. Ours is called the Launchpad. Okay, you're going to email Z, as in zebra, at eon.tv. Z, the letter Z one letter email address that's done for simplicity the letter z at eon.tv and just tell them you're interested and then they'll send, they'll send you information it'll take a couple of days because we're not ready to start that until monday but it'll take a couple of days and you just let them know you're interested uh that starts on friday you're letting them know you're interested and then we'll go from there all right ladies and gentlemen you'll receive training you'll receive training on how to understand the platform, exactly what they're doing. I already have people, like I said, who are already earning. I have people who have reached level three and level four on their earning scale. Okay, it really, they surpassed me is what I'm saying. They moved right past me. They've only, I've only been offering this to people for two weeks. Now this is the third week. They moved right past me as if I was sitting still because they are aggressive. They are understanding this. Some of them already knew how to do uh, spot trading and other trading. So they were far advanced than I was. So, yes, they're beyond me. And this is not a race. I don't mind them being beyond me as long as they get their eats and they allow other people to get their eats, too. And so they're bringing in their family and friends. And so this is what we're going to do for each person. Once you come in, if you want to bring in somebody else, you don't have to worry about training them. We will put them through the exact same training as you did. We will do it for free. You don't have to owe us a dime. Here is that special offer that I talked about in the title. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to bring in every month the people we bring in. And 10 people a month, we're going to give $175 to in cryptocurrency. We're going to transfer it into your account. We're going to start doing this. Um... Well, we're going to start now, but we won't be transferring the funds until the 30th of May. However, we're going to start notifying the people that they're going to get $175 in cryptocurrency from me, not from the other members. That's coming directly from me. Pay attention. I don't owe none of you any of this. I'm not doing this because I owe somebody something. I'm letting you know. Pay attention. I am doing this for you all. It will be random. It won't be because you're my friend. It won't be because you're my neighbor. It won't be because you're my cousin. It won't be because you only have one leg and one eye and you don't know how to see tomorrow. It won't be because of any of that. Randomly, I will pick 10 people. I might even use ChatGPT to pick the 10 people from a list. Randomly. And I will make sure that the list is randomly, 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 because I'll have him do it randomly six times and have him to pick the ones that were the least ones picked or the most ones picked. I'll do it so much so that none of you can create your own algorithm for figuring it out. You feel me? All right, but we're going to do 10 people a month. And I don't know if it's going to be just 175 or more. I, I haven't figured it out yet. And I'll tell you this, the other thing is the staff members that are helping at SACOM and SAA and AmeriLegion, we're going to be adding funds to their account so that they can also benefit from their assistance and assisting all of you. I told you, this was being done for the company. It wasn't being done for me. So we're going to take care of some of our net operating losses all of this time. Hey, everybody, I hope this information was beneficial. I hope this bonus information at the end proves beneficial to each one of you. Just remember, if you want to be a part of it and you're not a part of it, and if, even if you have family and friends that you want to bring in, we will provide the training for free. 
and who knows, they could be one of those who get the extra cryptocurrency. Look, they're gonna. Everybody starts off at $175, but here it is. You're gonna get another $175 from us at no cost to you. We're gonna transfer that to your account. But again, we're not gonna. We're gonna do that for the next every week. Every week, we're gonna find 10 people that we bring in. Every week. And those 10 people that we bring in, we're going to transfer at least 175. I know it's going to be more, but I can't tell you how much because I haven't figured it out yet. At least 175, but those monies are coming out of my pocket. Those coins are coming out of my pocket. They're coming from the monies that I get as a result of my trades, not the company's trades. That's coming from me because you guys should already know that's what I do. Okay, and don't let there be that uh, bonus that's coming. Because I have two investments where I got bonuses coming. And so I will do what I can to assist what I can. All right, ladies and gentlemen, yes, the dollar is crashing. All the other bills are they're talking. Banks are crashing all that. Not cryptocurrency. Just understand there are a million people invested in this. This has nothing to do with the dollar. It has nothing to do with the valuation against the dollar. Like that idiot was saying that it was 0. 1.0006 of a cents of a dollar or four cents of a dollar. No, it isn't. That thing is trading at $70 a share. How is it 0.4% of a U.S. dollar? $70 a share. So that's the, I don't know why there's so much jealousy. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we have done what we said we were going to do. Now we're going to let y'all do what y'all said y'all going to do, and that is go ahead and do your research, check into it before you get into it. Okay? You don't have to rush you don't have to break your neck okay you just have to do your research gotta go y'all take care